So it won't be too long before they're called in for our second pony race. And then come and join us in the winner's enclosure. We'll be making the prize giving. And we have someone very, very famous to present the prizes for the pony races right after this race. So the runners are at the start. The trip is a mile and a quarter. And I'm in the commentary box, James Reynolds. Thanks, Tomo. Yeah, the ponies have now all arrived at the start. And there are bookies in the ring. So you can have a flutter on the pony races. And it should be a really, really close race here as we wait for White Water to arrive at the one and a quarter mile start. Starter has mounted his rostrum. Liza McPherson aboard Buddy's Girl is just having her tack checked. And she will join the other eight ponies circling at the one mile two furlong start. Starter has raised his flag, walking forward. And it's a false start. So they are going to be asked to come back once more. Starter Ryan Colley is just waiting for Buddy's Girl and Eliza McPherson to return to the start, which won't take too long. And then they'll have a second go at starting this pony race. It's Father Ted bidding to have a sixth win of the season. He won this race last year with Mason on board. We have a handicapping system this year, which means they go up a couple of pounds for each win. And it's Father Ted is on the top weight in this contest. Warren Fentiman rides Class Act Annie. This pony won three times last year 
Warren's only had two rides on Classic Tally last time. And it was a very good finish Warren gave this pony last time out at Bangor on D, finishing second to its father Ted that afternoon, only four weeks ago now. Beating Malo Royale, who's got really good stamina. So interesting to see how Classic Tanny goes today on eight stone 12, which is well over a stone less than its father Ted. The ponies are being asked to walk forward once more. Stand by. They're off away in racing for our second Dragon Studios pony race over a distance of one mile, two furlongs. And the early leader is disputed here. But it's Father Ted and Mason Patel. Looks like he's got the early leaders. He's overtaken now by the Green Monk and Harry Vigers in the green jacket. It's Father Ted on the inside rail. Then the orange colours of Holly Dove in a second position. And to the outside of those is Warren Fentiman in the, the starred cap aboard Class Act Annie as they crown this gentle bend. The leader continues to be its Father Ted. To the outside is the green colours of the Green Monk who now moves into the lead. So it is the Green Monk by two lengths in second. It's Father Ted. Holly Dove in third class act Annie sitting in fourth position at this stage to the inside then is Buddy's Gurner Lising McPherson the striped cap just ahead of the red and white cap of Annie are you okay on the outside then the nose band of Lady Moon Dancer is in eighth position just ahead of the cork man and Kara Took with those distinctive red sleeves as they continue with half a mile behind them now and it's about ten lengths top to tail and around seven lengths between the first eight and the leader continues to be the green monk here by a about a length with Harry Vigers on board the Stratford winner to the outside the purple colours of its father Ted tacking right in now as the grey pony of white water with Lowen Cruz Mills bidding to have a double on today's card in third position is the red and white cap of Buddy's Girls the inside is Holly Dove then sitting behind those is the red colours of Annie are you okay and behind these then comes Lady Moon Dancer on the outside of Class Act Annie in the red colours of the star on cap that's Warren Fentiman on Class Act Annie as they now line up for the judge and there's still plenty of chances here with three and a half furlongs left to run down the Naysmire but there's a real hammer and tongs battle up front between on the far side the Green Monk and its father Ted the lead's been disputed since flag fall two and a half furlongs left to run the Green Monk on the far side its father Ted is powering up the centre of the course with Mason Patel on board then behind these are the green and white of Lady Moon Dancer then the grey of White Water is rallying two then the red and white of Annie are you okay and Ryan Kokorin in fifth but inside the final furlong and a half the purple and yellow of its father Ted still has the lead here. The only B caught. It's Father Ted and Mason Patel lead by two lengths. White Water is accelerating up the centre of the course in the red and blue, but it is still It's Father Ted going down towards the line. Only 50 yards to run. It's desperate here. It's Father Ted far side. White Water near side. It's Father Ted just wins in second White Water. Then it's really tight in third position between Lady Moon Dancer and the Green Monk. Behind these was the red and white of Annie Are You OK? Ahead of Class Act Annie, Holly Dove, Buddy's Girl and the Cork Man.